Belmont is a nature preserve that is uh, just 20 miles outside of St. Paul. And so we're part of the science program in the district. Ecologically, it's a dream to teach here. It's a really unique experience. I love that the students are able to get out of the city, to be in nature, to be in a peaceful place. Uh, my favorite part of coming out here is really s just seeing the place. It's so mesmerizing. We were looking at the environment and uh, how it feels, looks, and sounds. We're going to the different like environments and seeing what sort of different life is there. So our kids are here to learn about what species live in Minnesota, and as a bonus to learn about the biomes that those species live in. Our seventh graders do a project we call a phenology calendar, where each child has a different Minnesota species that they get to research throughout the school year, and then we do artwork and climate change research around each species, and we produce a calendar that's published. They had us like taking samples of the air and the moisture in the, in the, in the dirt, and bugs in the grass and stuff in the different biomes. Grasslands, meadows, all of those are different biomes. But we're using the compass as a vehicle to take them to these habitats um, in small groups of, of students so they feel, feel immersed in the habitat where they are and they can see how all this, it's you know three-dimensional learning, how all this stuff works together. So whether it's the birds that they hear or whether it's the plants that they're looking at, um, that is all uh, a connected ecosystem. It was really fun. I liked doing it. Um, it felt like I was doing something cool, you know. The St. Paul Public School program is named Bellwin uh, because uh, without Bellwin Conservancy, we would not be able to operate here. Uh, they provide all the land, the facilities. They donate over $100,000 worth of goods and services to keep this place running that our school district doesn't cover at all. So we've had that partnership for 50 years now and um, there's an open house on October 9th to celebrate that partnership. And uh, that open house will take place here at the education property, which is normally closed to the public, uh, but also at numerous other properties. If you'd like to learn any more about the October 9th open house, to go to the Bellwin Conservancy website, and that's simply just bellwin.org.